nobody, yo Change your mind when I change my life and I start believing Although the butterfly and the caterpillar are completely different, they are one and the same. What's poppin' YouTube? It's your girl, Cornelay. Back with another video. Y'all already know what's going on. Y'all already know what's going on. That being said, you know what I'm saying? Happy holidays. Gonna keep these videos coming and rolling this month. But this being said, that being said, I'm about to react to every return at WWE Royal Rumble 2020. So the Royal Rumble actually is coming up next month. And that's crazy that I'm even saying that next month. That being said, y'all, I'm just getting into it. Let's see these returns. Y'all already know what returns that I was hyped for. Edge being said this this year, that was really unexpected. I think that was the best return. Also, Naomi coming back from wherever she was at. But that being said, let's get into it. And MVP, bro. Even though him and the Hurt Business get on my nerves now. But MVP was shocking too. I ain't gonna lie. Let's get into it, though. The Wait, hold on, let me go back. All right, there we go. The first Royal Rumble of the 2020s is in the books. Of course, the highlights are the actual Royal Rumble matches. I'm not gonna lie, this why, like, the Royal Rumble 2020 was the best Royal Rumble to me. I think I liked the, the women more, but, but Edge was, like, the best part of the whole thing for me. But I always look forward to the returns. The 2020 Rumble Same. saw a few familiar faces Same. make a comeback, so let's the run through all of them. Most Let's begin with the Men's Royal Rumble, where Brock Lesnar entered at number one. He basically trampled everybody who entered, keeping the ring pretty empty for a good portion of the match. The Beast looked to keep that going, as he waited for number 12 to come out. I just don't like Brock Lesnar and everyone's surprised, and including like, mine, it was MVP. Know. Before stepping into the ring, Mr. 305 dropped oh, yeah, his shades off at the announcer's MVP table back, and gave Paul sure. Heyman a little chase. Lesnar eventually got his- All right. Excuse me. All right, y'all. So this person's channel will be down below. I just want to say that follow and subscribe. All right, down below. Hands at MVP, but the franchise player didn't come with just bling and gave the WWE champion some fight. It didn't last long as the Beast L5. in that five and eliminated and he got until eliminated. the previous border. Yo. The signs all pointed to it, and they were true. Almost nine years after retiring, Edge made his return to the WWE. As soon as he was in the ring, this just was the biggest one. Just about everyone when Edge came back, I gave him the biggest pop because, like, nine years gone and you coming back, like, that's weird, bro. Like, and, like, that, that day was already a bad day because Kobe Bryant, what happened to Kobe and his daughter, rest in peace to them. Like, that was, you know, that day wasn't it, but... I'm glad, like, that day, that took my mind off of it. Edge coming back Match. was really good. After settling into the Rumble, Edge then went after one of the last people that was he amazing. with, Dolph Ziggler. I wish Ziggler. I was out there. With some assistance and that was, like, one Corbin, of the last events. The show-off laid out his former rival. AJ Styles then turned his attention to the Radar Superstar. Seeing he was in danger, Edge spun things around and ended up eliminating the Phenomenal One. Unfortunately, this momentum didn't last long, as the Hall of Fame began taking a decent amount of abuse. Luckily, an old ally changed that, as Randy Orton entered and Ray and RKO reunited to take control of the match. Their dominance only lasted so long, as new entrants filled the ring, but despite this, Edge managed to make it to the Final Four. With the ring mostly cleared, Ray and RKO got back in the driver's seat. After Randy Orton teased an RKO, Edge decided not to take any chances and eliminated his partner. Dang, Edge now with only two other Randy. men in the match, the Canadian wrestler turned his attention to Roman Reigns. I want to know who he's going to Their battle eventually moved with. to the ring apron, where a well-placed uppercut caused title, Edge to hit the floor. Edge. The first return of the women's rumble happened early. Bianca Belair did really good in this match, bro. She eliminated a lot of people, bro. I love Bianca Belair, like one of the best, bro. I, I, I like, man. Man, this girl gonna be pressure. She already pressure, but look, when she she deserve a championship. I don't care. In the match, the third person to enter was the Hurricane sidekick. I still Mighty want her Molly. to win the NXT championship. She took championship. down both Alexa Bliss oh, yeah, and Bianca Holly. Belair until the next entrant, Nikki Cross, came out. With a fourth body Shout in the match, Molly, Molly formed a temporary alliance okay. with Belair as they bowed the former Molly, women's Molly, Molly. champions. Even though it had been two years since her last time in a WWE ring, Mighty Molly held her Why own she not until being eliminated fame? by Bianca That's what Belair. I want to know. While she hasn't that had many matches in WWE, the Mercedes Martinez does have a history in the company, yeah. competing Ooh, in the Mae Young Classic and making a few appearances in NXT, so her entrant at number 6 marked her return. She put in a good effort, and it ultimately took two women to force her out of the ring. While it's only been a few months since we last saw her, I'm going to include Tamina on this list. 
she entered at number 14 and started off strong, taking down just oh, about Sabina. everyone in the ring. Let's Bianca Belair ended up being her roadblock, and yeah, the two traded some violent her. shots at each other. They have a few. The NXT star like ultimately eliminated the former like 24-7 champion when she pulled a fast a one on Tamina and sent her to the floor. Having taken some time off to heal in 2019, Naomi entered the Royal Rumble fully charged. She took yes, down Bianca Naomi. Belair Naomi. and began battling with Charlotte Flair. She continued bruh, to- Bruh, hey man, look, when Naomi came back, bruh, I was about, like, I was happy as heck, bruh. I love Naomi, bruh. Like, I really do because I feel like, like, I feel bad in a way of how I did Naomi because, like, I didn't watch wrestling no more until I found Sasha again, and that was unexpected, and that was, like, crazy that how I found Sasha again, but that being said, like, Naomi, I started watching Naomi in NXT when AJ- then was down in NXT, but pulled her own throughout the match. I love the but proved her resilience right when she survived elimination she did by latching onto the side Morrison of the barricade. Thing. She took some time to plot her next move and ended up using a piece of the announcer's table to make a bridge back into the ring. Unfortunately, her return to the match was over pretty was quickly so as Shayna Baszler Shana pulled Naomi her above the top like rope, like eliminating her for good. Bro. At number 19 was the Glamazon, Beth oh, Phoenix. Bill. Being a fresh entrant, Bill, it made it easy for her to lay out the current competitors. However, that changed quickly when she absorbed a crossbody from Naomi. She settled into the match and even hit a couple of glass signs, but though. things picked up again when her former tag partner, her Natalia, came into though. the match. The two made for a dominant duo and made it to the final four. However, their alliance only lasted up, so long as Phoenix double-crossed Natalia before being eliminated herself. Kelly Kelly entered at number 21 Kelly. and made Naomi her first target. Kelly. Tony Storm tried to take down the former Divas champion. Bruh, I, I ain't gonna lie, in this match, Kelly didn't really do nothing, bro. She did them little scissors. Okay, cool. Like, and, and like. <laughs> See Kelly's signature Hurricanrana and Stink Face. And Kelly stink Kelly face. continued to brawl with the NXT she star pretty, before trying pretty, to eliminate though. I liked the Kelly back then. Kelly's plan ended up backfiring as the Queen got Kelly Kelly on the like Kelly. I was supposed to meet Kelly this right hand, year. Thus eliminating the PG era. Diva. I was supposed to meet Kelly this now, year. Now, here was a shocker. At number 29, Miss WrestleMania herself, Santina Morella Santino. As soon as she got inside the ropes, Morella went face to face with the women she eliminated at WrestleMania 25, Beth Phoenix. I'm so dumb. Santina <laughs> attempted to patch up the relationship, <laughs> no, but the Glamazon I'm, wasn't having any of that. Right. After realizing it's she hilarious. was trapped, Santino's twin sister pulled out a familiar family pet and turned the cobra on herself, resulting in Santina Morella's elimination. Their I'm gonna put MVP, Edge, and Santina Morella <laughs> as my favorite, but who are yours? Share a comment with the returns that got you the most excited, and, and then Morella. leave the video on the that's right That's your off. favorite? With that, I'm he Zach from Cat Hall Corner, favorite. and take it Edge wasn't on the... Get out, bro. Get out. Get out of here. I'm gonna make my own video like this, to be honest. Like, you know? Alright. All right, y'all. So that's the end of this video. Um, this person's channel will be down below in the description. Go give them a follow, subscribe, all of that good stuff. This is every return at WWE Royal Rumble 2020. So honestly, uh, like my favorites in this video, um, was Edge number one because like nine years gone, like everybody that was everybody favorite, bro. But for the women, I think Naomi because she was gone a long time and I missed her. Uh, also Santina, that was, <laughs> that was hilarious. Um, so that being said, I think that was my favorite, you know what I'm saying? Um, MVP was a good one, but you know what I'm saying? Yeah, MVP was good, cause like, we ain't seen him a long time either, but my favorite, my most favorite was Edge, 100%. That being said, like, come subscribe, hit that notification bell. On to the next video, guys. Comment down below other video ideas, and I'ma, I'ma do them, alright? But yeah. Thank <laughs> you.